Okay. So basically, guys, I'm going to be teaching you how to get Lucraft Core. I'm not get. Well, how, how to use Lucraft Core. And the fifth dimension. So basically, all of this stuff is like Lucraft Core slash the fifth dimension. So, um, and this is a few extra mods. But, so here's all the Lucraft Core stuff that I want to show you guys. So if you guys go to the Lucraft Core section, let's just go on and get our safety stuff on because we're scientists. Looking sharp. Looking good. And so with your injection gun, looking sharp injection gun. That's because it is sharp. But um, so if you grab an empty vial, we're gonna need a few of them actually. Centrifuge microscope we're also going to need a desk so then what I'm going to do there and then let's make it there okay so you're going to take your vial put it in your off hand and then use your ejection gun by right clicking and then it should load it full so and then what you guys are going to do is you are going to um, hold shift down and left click and then that should take some of your blood then right click to unload it and then you have your blood in your hand and that's a blood sample from your character and once you mix stuff with it you can only put it into just you not other people unless it's with their blood so basically you're going to grab it again load a different one in and then you guys are gonna look for any mob. So I'm just gonna spawn one. Say you want to spawn an um creeper. Bad. Punch it, it'll take some of its blood. So basically once you have its blood, um you can do it with another animal if you want. I don't know what animal I should do this time. Maybe like a um Maybe an, um, no, maybe a witch would be good. Bat, 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 thanks for all the blood witch. Thanks for all that. So once you have all the witch's blood, it's just like a hundred bottles. I'm joking, it only took one. I just wanted to punch the witch. And you're gonna go into the microscope. And this see how it's from the witch? You put it under. Now, you can take certain ones out. So, inflict nausea on punch, healing punch, and then blinding punch. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do um, blinding punch. And then I'm gonna do blood sample from creeper, energy absorption, lightning strike, or lightning attack. I'll do lightning strike. And then you guys see your blood. You can like see what's in it, but I don't have anything good in mine. So you're gonna go into centrifuge and then see the two genes. Put them in. They'll start mixing. And then it should put an empty bottle on the left, and then this um, mixed genes on the right. And then you're gonna put your blood in the right, and then your mixed genes in the left. Because if you do it the other way around, it won't do anything. And then one. Once you have, that creates a serum and you can't add anything else to it once it's a serum. You can only inject it into yourself or whoever had that blood. So, and then you hold shift and then left click. So, you guys see I have the abilities in my top corner up here. And then, if I press that, it heals. Wait, does it heal? I'm pretty sure yeah, I picked it. I picked heal. Then if I press C, and shoot stuff with lightning. Zap. Zap the chicken. Oh, I think I'm, it's too far away. Poor chicken. Does this make him unkillable if it heals when I punch him? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it does. Oh, I picked blinding punch, didn't I? Yep, I did. 
I thought it was healing. Because it had the healing logo. But anyway, guys, um, that's most of it. But if you want to do it on a friend, you can also do that. So let's say that this villager is a friend. You can also take a piece of paper, an empty piece of paper. And then I'm going to get a fence going here. You guys put down Mr. Villager here. Can you walk through here? Okay, good. You can, which is not good. Put Mr. Villager inside of here. Oh, he's a scientist. Bat. Get it inside your bud. Thank you. Even though I don't need that. If I don't need it for a minute. Bye. Okay. So basically, now the bat. So now I have some of his blood, so that means that I can experiment on it and put them back in it. Spider? Scientist? Okay. That's a bit weird. So I'm gonna put his DNA in there, study it, see what it be. He only ha he's blind? I didn't know villagers were blind. And then I'm gonna take his blood. And then uh, say I'm gonna mix it with something like, say, uh... A zombie villager. What a coincidence. Don't, don't, don't get him. Don't you dare. There's another, there's another. There's another. Go, go get him. Go get him over there. Forgot I need another vial loaded in. Bat. So if I take the zombie filter, bat. And then I take its blood. I put it into there. Wait, no, I need to extract stuff from over. Healing factor, some zombies, or hunger immunity. None of that is really good abilities. How about I get a horse? Hor horses have some unique abilities. An, an empty vial. Uh -huh. Leviathan now. I don't want a Leviathan right now. <laughs> Bow, and then horse. Back. Sorry, horse. That, I know that may have hurt, but for science. So one of them is mountable. I'll just go on and get mountable from the inventory. Yeah. Basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take mountable and mix it with the villager's blood. It's kind of weird to say. Super weird to say. And then you take the serum. And because it's his serum, I can't inject it into me. See? But I can inject it into him. And if I quickly trade with him, it'll tell me what I can do. See? Mountable. Watch this. I'm ma I'm riding him. It's making it look like his eyes are popping out. I'm riding him. Uh oh. Not good. So basically, right. We're gonna be experimenting with some more stuff. So say you, say you got a bad ability. It's it's super annoying. Say it's super annoying, and uh, you don't like it at all. You're like, wow, this is super bad. I should not have not have tried this. And there actually is a way to do this, to fix it. So like, say that you use an injection. It takes it all out, and you can put it back in. And you can get your abilities back, but it only works on just you. So basically, say you make a bad, a bad, bad thing. Like a bad injection on yourself, and you don't like what its effects. What you would do is you're going to just get some more of your blood. Let me get it. And then, I'm going to put it in centrifuge. Mix it with this. And then this is, it should make a bad concoction that you don't want to put into yourself. Unless it is a trained expert right beside you. Which is not, not me, not me. I'm not a trained expert, so you shouldn't trust me to be beside you. 
to drop the extra vials. Dang. So basically now, I'm just going to get an extra empty injection. So one of these, look, I'm going to inject myself. Bam. So you guys see how annoying this is? Game mode. I'm not in game mode. Set. Slash set time. Wait. Slash set time date. Does that work? No. Slash set time. Slash time. Oh, I did it wrong. Slash time set 18,000. Hush set, t I mean, hush time set, 1800? There we go guys, so this is super annoying. So if you guys don't like it, just use an extra injection, it'll take it out for you. So, that's basically all there is to this tutorial, and um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.